Hello, welcome to the session. Today we are going to discuss about the Grignard reagent, the most important topic in the NEET examination. So, Victor Grignard made this reagent and Grignard reagent is one of the best tool in the organic conversions. Before going for a Grignard reagent, I just want to mention about the score examination, India's largest scholarship examination, why it is called India's largest scholarship examination. It gives the worth of 1 crore rupees scholarship and also many more things you are going to see a study setup and a laptop and educational allowances and uh, up to 100 percent of scholarships are available according to your performance benchmarking so while yet in the description box the link is available you all just click it and you enjoy the scholarship examination and it can be at any stage at any school you belong to or any college and you can sit at home and you can write this score online examination. So all the best my dear students link is available in the description box. And also one more important thing from infinity lane I just want to mention that is uh, test series pack for the NEET examination, all India test series, which include 27 EITS examination and uh, 13 unit test and 4 part test and 10 grant tests are available and uh, 20 online NEET full syllabus mock tests are available and 25 NEET topic wise PYQs are there and the 3 physics, chemistry, biology books are there along with the solutions on the app and also detailed solutions for performance benchmarking and also your performance is benchmarked with Sri Chaitanya students for the precise rank prediction. So, while it and this cost actually around 5999 and Infinity Learn is giving extended discount to you 50% slash once you apply this YouTube 50 off coupon then you are going to get 2999 it's a special discount and limited time offer you all just check in the description box link is available and click it and just grab this test series special discounted package and we'll go into the details about the Grignard reagent Victor Grignard got Nobel Prize to prepare this Grignard reagent when alkyl halide reacted with magnesium in ether dry ether you are going to get alkyl magnesium halide this alkyl magnesium halide is called as a Grignard reagent the ether should be dry in nature otherwise the Grignard reagent that is formed is going to be hydrolyzed and this Grignard reagent is a versatile reagent and let's see actually what is Grignard reagent. So this Grignard reagent is RMGX in a simple format I just want to give you the bond between the magnesium and this alkyl group is a polar in such a way that whenever Grignard reagent comes into the mind R- is a very good base. so that it can undergo acid base reactions as well as the other side it is an excellent nucleophile so it undergo nucleophilic reactions so it is having acid base reactions and nucleophilic reactions definitely from the neat examination you are going to get a question from this Grignard reagent and it is a tool in the organic chemistry let me give you simple trick to handle the questions in Grignard reagent and its uses in a synthetic organic chemistry. Let's see Grignard reagent as a base. Grignard reagent as a base. So Grignard reagent is a base. You are going to see R M G X. It is going to be plus and minus. So Grignard reagent is going to ready to take anybody who can give acidic hydrogen. So that R minus and H plus is going to give as RH alkene is formed. Now my trick comes into the picture. Who is going to give this H plus? Any compound that has a labile and free H plus can be given. Like you can see H2O can give, H2O can give H plus and OH minus. So that H plus can be used here. So alcohols can give gives rise ROH, RO minus and H plus and phenol can give, it gives rise a phenoxide ion and H plus like that anything terminal alkyls can give, 
you are going to get uh, acetylide like this and H plus like this. How many list of reactions in the entire chemistry you can use for here to give the alkane Grignard reagent when react with uh, uh, free H plus ion is going to give its corresponding alkane. So like this you just simply crack the question and you are going to see Grignard reagent as a base. Let us see Grignard reagent as a nucleophile, nucleophilic reactions. So Grignard reagents are nucleophiles. Nucleophile means a species which attack at positively charged carbon is going to be a nucleophile Grignard reagent or minus is a nucleophile. So it react with carbonyl carbon. This is your carbonyl carbon. And when it is reacted with the Grignard reagent or MgX. So carbonyl carbon you can see it is a partial negative charge. It is a partial positive charge. And this R minus is going to be a nucleophile can attack over here. So it is going to give you the further hydrolysis corresponding alkane. So that you can see O minus and MgX. And then further hydrolysis, you are going to break this by hydrolysis. And the product that you are going to see is going to be in alcohol. It is an alcohol. So in that I just want to give you formaldehyde HCHO when Grignard reagent is attacked or MgCl and followed by hydrolysis you are going to get a primary alcohol. This is your primary alcohol. Similarly, you are going to see any aldehyde other than formaldehyde when it is reacted with a Grignard reagent, you are going to get a secondary alcohol. And a ketone, it is an aldehyde. This aldehyde gives rise a secondary alcohol. And you can see the tertiary alcohol can be prepared from what? So it is should be from a ketone. So or C double bond O or when it is treated with RMGCL and uh, followed by acidic hydrolysis gives rise R and R and R dash and OH. So we are going to get a tertiary alcohol from the ketone. So you can see simple, first one is Grignard reagent as a base. Any compound that can have an acidic hydrogen can react with the Grignard reagent gives as alkane. Grignard reagent as a nucleophile, Grignard reagent react with uh, a carbonyl group, it gives rise its corresponding alcohol in that formaldehyde. When react with Grignard reagent followed by hydrolysis gives rise a primary alcohol. Grignard reagent react with any aldehyde except formaldehyde gives rise a secondary alcohol and a Grignard reagent react with a ketone and followed by further hydrolysis gives rise a tertiary alcohol. So these Grignard reagents can be used widely in a various areas to get its corresponding compounds. So like that if you have a question uh, based on an alcohol will be given by checking at whether it is a tertiary alcohol or secondary alcohol or a primary alcohol its corresponding carbonyl group either formaldehyde or any aldehyde or any ketone can be simply assessed and that is the area of the question you are going to get from the NEET examination. Like this in every topic and every key point we are going to make a videos like this. You please follow these videos in a series of videos and you are going to get so many tricks in this series of videos. So please like this session and share with your friends and subscribe to Neat Infinity Lens channel. Thank you. Thank you very much.